All right, ready to blast off, buckle up, because today we're diving deep into the cosmos, but through music. Oh, this is going to be fun. Love when we get to explore the universe through artistic lenses. Should be interesting. Definitely. And, you know, we only pick the most, um, let's say, unique tracks, and today is no exception. Yeah. We're tuning into Kurt Holes. He's got a song, Aliens Touched Uranus. Yeah, you heard that right. Catchy, that's for sure. Gotta hand it to Holes, always got a knack for a title that grabs you. But I bet there's more to it than just the wordplay, right? Oh, absolutely. At first glance, yeah, it's good for a chuckle, but listen closely to the lyrics. It's like he took a classic UFO sighting, you know, the blurry photos, and made it a song. The whole lights in the sky, bright and so high, here they come, don't be shy. It's like we're right there waiting for something incredible to happen. Totally. It's that classic sci-fi trope of anticipation, yeah. the wonder mixed with a little bit of, oh, what's going to happen? Whoa, whoa. Really sets the stage for, you know, an alien counter. But then it gets interesting. Oh, yeah. When he introduces the aliens themselves. Green little guys. Big surprise eyes. Like, come on, that's classic alien imagery right there. It is. But and here's the thing. That word surprised. That little detail throws a curveball into the whole thing. Think about it. We always imagine aliens as these super intelligent beings, right? Yeah, they're here to study us. They're way ahead of us technologically. I that whole it. idea, right? Exactly. But surprised flips that on its head. Suddenly, they're not so sure of themselves, are they? Makes you wonder if they're the ones a little freaked out to be here, especially on, well, Uranus. Like, who's really observing whom here? Whoa, I never thought about it like that. That one word changes the whole power dynamic. Speaking of unexpected, we got to talk about that chorus. I mean, you can't miss it, right? Mm -hmm. Aliens touched Uranus. It's bold. It's funny. But what's Holes really getting at with that repeated touched? It's definitely not just a topical touch he's singing about. It's more like a point of contact. Two completely different worlds, ours and theirs, suddenly bumping into each other. The question is, what happens next? What's left behind after that touch? And he kind of answers that later on, doesn't he? You mean that line made it feel contagious. That one really got me thinking. Like, the encounter itself, it's not just a one-time thing. It spreads, right? Exactly. It's like this ripple effect. And this is where it gets really interesting in a lot of sci-fi alien encounters. They're not really about aliens at all. They're metaphors. For what, though? For our anxieties, our hopes, the big changes happening in society. So that contagious feeling, it could be about how contact, even just the idea of contact, changes everything, makes us question our place in the universe, you know? Wow, heavy stuff. See, this is why we love to deep dive. But it's not all deep thoughts, right? Holes also takes us on this crazy ride with descriptions of flying ships hovering, even throws in a cosmic slip. It's like boom, 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 image after image. He's a master at that. It's like he's painting a picture in your mind, right? And you're right, he keeps it moving. That cosmic slip always gets me so simple, but is it a near miss? Did they almost collide with something else out there? Or maybe it's about how vast space is, how these encounters could be fleeting, just gone in an instant. Man, so much to unpack in just a few lines. It's amazing how he could be so silly and thought-provoking at the same time. Right. And that's the beauty of music. It can sneak up on you, make you think about things in a whole new light. We started with what seemed like a joke about aliens and Uranus, and here we are contemplating the vastness of the universe and our place in it. Exactly. And that's what makes you think... If we ever do encounter something out there, something truly alien, how will we react? With fear, wonder. Maybe we'll just burst into song. Who knows? But that's something for you all out there to ponder. On a cosmic 